I'd just like to confirm that, yes, some of my best friends are not racist. <laughs> Although it's just some of them, so racists, I can be your friend. <laughs> just talk to my agent at Black Friends or Us. <laughs> A Negro friend finder. <laughs> so, I'm here for you. If a T-Rex gave the Nazi salute, would anyone notice? <laughs> because they're extinct. <laughs> The first rule of Alzheimer's Club is, we're talking about Alzheimer's Club, it's a thing. Um, the first rule of Alzheimer's Club is, there is no Alzheimer's Club. Although it's less a rule and more a natural law. <laughs> it's not man-made. The second rule of Alzheimer's Club is, you don't have Alzheimer's, Alzheimer has you. <laughs> you know, because it's apostrophe S, so it's a possessive. <laughs> Although it's less a rule and more grammatical law. <laughs> the third rule of Alzheimer's Club is... <laughs> the third rule of Alzheimer's Club is, if I pretend to forget the joke, it will be hilarious. <laughs> Although it's less, and again, it's less a rule and more a law of Alzheimer's jokes. <laughs> I like that joke. <laughs> Tip for tat is not a profitable business model for tattooists. <laughs> Okay, um, many, people, many, many people say they love taking long, hot showers. They love long, hot baths. But all I hear when people say they love long, hot showers and baths is, I love hot boxing sebum and dead skin. Okay, you didn't, you, you didn't react to it, but that is a great joke. <laughs> and it's a great joke because it's also true. Drugs equal showers. Bats equal drugs, and vice versa. Think, think about it. You, you, you know how being high just destroys your taste in music? Just like showers make you think you can sing. <laughs> and you know how the sebum munchies make you get breakfast after you shower? I know how you get your best ideas in the shower and when you're high. <laughs> So they're the same. I think the academic term is QED biatch. 